everyone. So the following video um, was very long and is, is very long. So um, there's of course no obligation to watch or anything. I don't even start talking about food until after four minutes, ten seconds. Um, but um, I'm alright. I just wanted to, I'm gonna post the video, the whole video, but I just wanted to let you know I'm fine, I'm okay, I'm just tired and exhausted, so, um, and I keep, you'll notice that I keep rubbing my nose, I think it's a nerves thing, I, I need to learn, I don't really know what to do with my hands when I talk, so, um, if I'm not gesturing <laughs> like a crazy person, I'm usually touching my face, so I'm working on that, um, have a great week everyone, um, just, just, I'm okay. Thanks. Hi everyone, it's Julia. Isn't it absolutely beautiful outside? Ah, the snow has melted and the grass is now green again. And it started to rain in Virginia, but we're only two degrees colder than in Los Angeles. So that's, that's good and we have no wind. But the humidity is coming in and yesterday I went outside and my hair went automatically poofed up and um that's that's something to look forward to of course i'm on spring break now school starts again on monday and i'm not looking forward to it i have not gone i haven't gone home for spring break i've just been here in my dorm um actually my dorm is in pretty good shape and not not at all extremely messy it's it's been messier so i suppose that's good um i've just been watching TV and haven't been to the gym because of my ankle which is healing but often um I often I I because because it's healing so well I forget about it and I step wrong and and it starts hurting again so I want to make sure that it, I want to give it as much time to heal as possible before I start running again um when my friends get back from Richmond where they went to for spring break I'll be going to the gym, maybe do the rowing machine instead of running for the first for the first while because um, I don't want my foot to be <laughs> to go bad again. Um, I had a few interviews over the past months. I got two rejections already. Waiting on two more responses. And then I will, if nothing, if they don't get me again, I'll start sending out my resume to the West Coast. I'm thinking it might be a bit more difficult because I won't be able to fly out for an interview. But on the other hand, the West Coast is where I'm from and it might be easier to get a job there. And there's so many opportunities. You know, in marketing, everyone needs a marketing department. Everyone from Toys R Us to Disney to Godiva Chocolate to <laughs> any company needs a marketing department. And I just need to, to find them and, and learn about the companies and send out my cover letters and everything. Um, but that's, it's so draining. And this, this spring break, we got a take home exam, which I can't fit for the life of me. I just can't sit down and do it. I'm, I'm exhausted. Like, all I can think about is how I want to get out of school and how I can't wait to finish and how. Uh, there's still over, well, there's a year, and I have to make up all the credits that didn't transfer from my community college. Only 54 transferred, and I needed to transfer with 60, so I'm six units short. So I'll be, if I don't get an internship, I'll be taking summer sessions, and I'm just so exhausted. But I'll be taking the summer sessions if I don't get an internship. I'll be taking winter, because next next fall and spring I'll be have to I'll have to be looking for an actual job a real job to launch my career because I'm gonna have my bachelor's in May of 2011 God willing and I I don't want to go back to school ever not for grad school not for anything I think next time I want to go to school is to find a school for my children and <laughs> I I can't I can't stand the I can't stand the exams. I can't stand... <laughs> I just want to work. And, um, I'm so sorry this is going to be a long video, but I've just had it bottled up for so long. And this week, okay, <laughs> food-wise, um, this week has been fine. I just had, um, two pieces of Ezekiel bread with a banana smeared on top, like a crushed banana on top. 
so I've been pretty healthy. I've been drinking my water constantly and eating fruits. Um, I had I had some ice cream over the week and um, some chips here and there, but I'm all right. I feel okay. My skin's not too bad, and my face looks better, I think, now than it did last week. And so once my friends come back and we start going to the gym again, I always do that. I always say, well, I'm home, so once I go to university, I'll be able to take control of my life. But now that I'm here, there's just... <sighs> it's so draining, and I'm and I, I'm on one week, but off the next. So I can't, I can't be consistent. And I really, I need to be consistent, and I need to... <sighs> I don't know if I'm going to start doing Weight Watchers online. I don't really have time, um... I don't know. I don't have the time, I don't have the money, and, um, frankly, I don't really have the energy. So, I was also thinking if, if I could take a year off after graduation. But on the, but on the other hand, this, I go to, I go to the McIntyre School of Commerce, and we're, like, at the, f at the front of evolving business world and this year we're number two after Notre Dame for undergraduate business school but last year we were number one and we had a lot of recruiters come so I know that with with a degree from here I'll be you know I'll be fine um but and, and I have time I I'll I won't yet be 20 by my graduation date um so there there's plenty of time to to take a year off or two if I wanted to, but but I'm afraid that if I do, then not only will I completely lose all motivation to work or anything like that, but I would have wasted wasted the opportunity to jump into a career, um, which I ha which I have the chance to do now, being from this university, and. Um, the good thing is, I don't stutter anymore. I don't know if you remember, but last semester I would stutter all the time. I, I don't know if it was nerves or what, um, and I couldn't sleep last semester. This semester, now that I've been, well, we have been going to the gym pretty consistently. It's just these past, um, two and a half weeks that I haven't gone. Um, I, I still sleep very well, so maybe that was nerves, but I have, like, a feeling of sadness, and... I don't know, just, just not wanting to do anything, but then I want to do everything at the same time, like, I want to, I want to go travel, I want to go bungee jumping, I want to, I want to learn, but I want to learn outside of school, I, I, I don't want to see another textbook, I don't want another paper, another deadline, and there's so many of them, right now I am ongoing, three, they are ongoing and simultaneous three group projects for three different classes, and I am just <sighs> exhausted. But for the change of change of mood, um, I listen to some music and um, to to really get me m moody and 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 brooding, um, Leonard Cohen, and then to get me out of it, Bonnie McKee, for a voice that carries. It's an amazing song. I'm gonna try to link it in the side. Anyway, guys. Have a great week. Um, thanks for watching, if you're still watching. And I had a good Weight Watcher week. It wasn't perfect. It was good. I don't know how much I weigh, but I know I made some progress from where I was before spring break.